Hey, vive la lui here, keyboard player and explosive. I started playing keys in the womb. My mother was pregnant and she was on stage playing in my father's band, playing keyboards into his band. They were covering songs of Yes, Kansas, you know, uh, Genesis and playing that stuff live while I was in her belly. So uh, her Moog synthesizer was hanging in the living room. So I would play with that as I grew up. Uh, I was sitting on the lap of the drummer at rehearsals. So yeah, I've been raised in music and especially rock and prog rock of the 70s. I lived the 80s all the way through two years old until 12. So um, that pretty much defined me, you know, as a, as a music lover and musician. I have uh, much love for the music of the 80s and obviously the 90s too, because I started going to college high school and I started to find other minds alike, you know, people who share my taste for music and with who I could listen music with or play music together. I think this is a great album. I love this record now, taste and color, some will love it, some will hate it. It doesn't matter. I think people can hear that we have been very passionate in every sense of the word, making it. It sounds just like A through Z. We obviously have big influences, but I'm pretty sure that when people will listen to this record, they will hear something special to come up with your own sound that people can recognize instantly within seconds of uh, hearing your songs. And uh, if we succeed to achieve that, I think that's great. That's the most important in the end, to have our own identity. In terms of favorites on the album, I would say Machine Gunner, Stranded, sometimes. I mean, I, I love all of the songs. I think they are pretty diverse. Uh, you don't hear two times the same thing on a record, which is something I like. And oh yeah, I also dig uh, Far Side of the Horizon. And this one was uh, really tough to write, at least when it came to the chorus. I remember that uh, I was stuck and couldn't figure out for the best of me what would be the chorus. And I just left it aside and came back to it several months later. The best thing sometimes is just to sit down, take the time to think, maybe step back a little and uh, be sure that you take a good turn because nothing good comes out of uh, being in a hurry. So uh, yeah, I just laid it aside and uh, I'm really happy with how it came out in the end. Thank <laughs> you.